Hello, football enthusiasts, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we've got some thrilling news to cover, a deep dive into the world of football finances. According to Forbes, Cristiano Ronaldo has clinched the title of the highest paid footballer in 2023, and the numbers are astonishing. Stick around as we unravel this exciting story. At the pinnacle of the football earnings mountain stands none other than Cristiano Ronaldo. Forbes not only labels him as the highest paid footballer but also the highest paid athlete across all sports. Ronaldo's expected total earnings for 2023? Brace yourselves, it's a jaw-dropping $260 million. Where does this astronomical sum come from? It's a mix of a massive $200 million contract with Saudi Arabian club Al Nasser, which he joined from Manchester United in January, and a star-studded endorsement portfolio including giants like Nike and Jacob & Co, estimated at $60 million annually, as reported by Forbes. Holding the second position on Forbes' list is Lionel Messi, with expected total earnings of $135 million. Messi's move to MLS club Inter Miami has significantly boosted his earnings. He's now the first MLS player to grace the top 10 since the legendary David Beckham did in 2012. And securing the third spot is Brazil's Neymar, with total earnings of $112 million, after his signing with Al Hilal in the Saudi Pro League in August. The impact of the Saudi Pro League is clearly evident, with four players, Ronaldo, Neymar, Karim Benzema, and Sadio Mane, in the top 11 highest-earning footballers worldwide. Forbes reveals that the combined income of these four players accounts for more than half of the collective $995 million earned by the top 11. Outside of the top three, we have some other football giants. Kylian Mbappe follows closely behind his former PSG teammate Neymar with total earnings of $110 million. Manchester City's Erling Haaland takes the title of the highest-paid Premier League player, with an annual income higher than Liverpool's Mohamed Salah and teammate Kevin De Bruyne. Forbes' methodology is interesting. On-field earnings encompass all prize money, salaries, and bonuses earned in the past year, while off-field earnings include an estimate of sponsorship deals, appearance fees, licensing income, and returns from businesses the players operate. As we wrap up this incredible story, it's clear that football isn't just a game on the pitch, it's a massive industry off it. These earnings reflect the hard work, dedication, and business acumen of these superstars. If you enjoyed learning about the financial side of football, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated with more exciting football news. What are your thoughts on these staggering earnings? Share them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video.